Hello, good people of... Oh, oh, shit. Hello, good people of the internet. Welcome to vlog number one. It's currently 10.30 p.m. on a Friday night. I don't know who starts vlogging this late. I've got a leg workout to hit up tonight. I hate training this late, but you gotta get it done. I'll take you to the gym with me. We will do squats, and I will try not to fall asleep. It will all be fine. That's not gonna work. Cheeky outfit change because it's not acceptable to wear pajamas to the gym. So yeah, we're gonna go kill it. Why am I singing everything? Yep, okay, we're going. If you don't listen to really hype music on the way to the gym, do you even lift? <laughs> I believe next week I'm starting my powerlifting program. This week's kind of my last week to do whatever I feel like. I'm thinking to do some kind of light squats for relatively high reps. I always start with my compound, so I'll smash out some squats, probably move on to a little bit more glute isolation work, and I think I'll throw in a little bit of hamstrings. That's the plan for today. made a quality mess. In terms of what I take pre-workout and intra-workout, I usually just have coffee. Obviously it's 10 p.m. so I'm not going to have coffee because I really need to sleep tonight. Intra-workout, I've always used Extend BCAAs. I'm currently on green apple flavor. Use my code Rochelle10 at the... <laughs> I'm fucking joking, I wish. I forgot to mention, I'm starting to add in cardio to my cutting program. I'll do 15 minutes today. I'll do a detailed video on what I'm doing for this cut later on. So we have to hit cardio after legs too. It's true, baby, let the light shine through. If you believe it's true, baby, won't you let the light To the night, I raise my hand to the fire, but it's no use, cause you can't stop it from shining through, it's true, baby let the light shine through, if you believe it's true, baby won't you let the light shine through.
done, I have to put some fuel in my car on the way home. So let go. post-workout just before bed a cheeky quest bar i never do this i usually have a good protein source from meat with some veggies yes. that was meant to be all melted and really food porny but it looks shit it tastes good so it's fine it's fine It is Saturday morning, I'm gonna weigh myself, have some breakfast, and then I'm off to work. I'm not even that hungry because my last meal was only four hours ago. One thing I really try and avoid doing when I'm cutting is eating when I'm not hungry. I'm not gonna have breakfast, I'm just gonna take a shake with me. I'm just really tired and I want to be back in bed already. <laughs> But nah, we gotta grind. We gotta grind. Today, actually having a refeed. It's all gonna be tracked. Nothing too outrageous because we wanna we wanna keep progress sailing. We only wanna do things that are gonna help us be better. Something I've been loving lately is Amanda Bucci's podcast. It's on SoundCloud under Bucci Radio. She just interviews a lot of people regarding different fitness related topics. Educational AF. That is not pretty. I got my certifications <laughs> that day because of my brother. And sure oh, no, no, no. I tell people all the time. Oh, okay. So the song, so actually, I'm pretty sure whatever it's sad. Yeah. And just start. Long blocks of life. I just finished work. I had a protein shake today. I've only had about 120 calories. I'm gonna head home now. I'm just gonna have a little chat while I'm driving. I don't even know if you can hear me. Basically, for my refeed, I was initially going to go out to get sushi tray, but you get to a point when you're dieting that you really want to optimize what you eat, and I'm not interested in eating anything that's going to hinder my progress. Sushi tends to have a lot of fat. And I really don't need to be eating fat. Still tracking all my calories. Jesus. Gonna be interesting. I'm not really sure how much heavier I'm going to wake up. I think I'll wake up at least 0.8 kilos heavier, but gotta sacrifice, right? And my workouts have been absolute shit. At first I thought it was my iron levels. My iron levels always drop low because I never eat enough red meat. But then I also don't sleep enough. I'm also dieting, so I'm putting my body through a lot. So I'm I'm not, I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. I'm so tired. Yeah, that's the go for tonight and yeah, it should be fun. You know, diet is in full effect. When the car is full of cold drip cups, Coke Zero bottles and water bottles. <laughs> I've got about 30 grams worth of carbs, some chicken breast and trusty sriracha hot sauce on top. Creatine mixed in water there. Just got to the gym. I'm doing deadlifts and hitting back and a little bit of glutes. I'm not gonna film this one because I only have about 40 minutes or so. We gon' kill it. I never talk like this. I don't know why I'm putting on this bullshit persona. Sorry, I'll um, work on it. <laughs> Peace. <laughs> I never do that either. What the fuck's going on? Workout is done. I'm feeling depleted as Fuck. Couldn't pick a better time to do a refeed. I don't generally schedule in cheat meals or refeeds weekly. I kind of just do it on a random basis and it's all dependent just on how I feel. Usually I can tell I need um, a carb up when my workouts start feeling like a suicide mission. Off to pick up my friend and then we're going to Chadston and God, stop. Which ones are the good ones? The Snickers ones? Yeah, no Snickers. 
These are amazing though. Um, Imagine cool. them heated up with ice cream in between them. Oh my god. So you've got the white and you've got multi-grain. <coughs> Same amount of protein and fat as the multi-grain, but that has 24 grams of carbs and this has about 17. So this one it is. Also a staple. Yum! Currently on search for the perfect tub of ice cream before everything closes. Decided to get a tub of this. That's pretty good. Check these macros. 94 calories oh, per serve. There's five serves. Two protein, 3.5 fat and 13 carb. I'm about to eat this whole thing. Friendship is when your friend brings spoons to dinner so you can go buy ice cream after. We were gonna go for a drive, but we're pathetic. So we're just gonna chill in the chatty car park. This is really romantic. I've got that much, like I think I'm up to here. I'm like slowly falling into carb coma. Oh, the raspberry's so strong. I'm honestly so full right now. I had all day to eat carbs and I'm trying to fit it into three hours. Third supermarket. <laughs> Fourth supermarket of the night, which is that cool. Thanks. I feel like cereal, so I'm going to Elaine's house and I'm gonna eat Nutri-Grain for my last soy milk. I kind of said I was gonna eat Nutri-Grain, but Elaine has this um, <laughs> nougat and no, I kind of want it. The whole thing's about 80 grams of carbs. I do not recommend this. This is actually really good. Oh, I'm about to fall asleep. I have new girls stuff. Oh.